You guys asked for it, so I'm gonna give it to you. I'm Barrett, and this is Spec of Tech, and today we're gonna be doing some demos of the Funk Audio LFE 24 Ultra. So I just released the full review of this behemoth of a subwoofer, and I did get some comments about doing some more demos, but if you guys are interested in watching the review video, I will link it in the top right hand corner of this one, so feel free to check that out after this video. And if you guys are into audio and home theater, that is what my channel is all about, so please consider subscribing and tick the bell icon so you can be notified about my future videos, and if you like monster subwoofers like this, make sure to hit that like button. If you guys are interested in meeting other people that are into this crazy hobby that we have, uh, home audio and home theater. I do have some awesome supportive Facebook groups. Make sure to check the links down below for those groups. I'd be happy to have you there. And also feel free to follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description as well. All right guys, so let's get into these demos. So the settings I'm gonna be using is a negative four dB gain on the subwoofer and the level on the ADR for the subwoofer is gonna be set to negative five dB. And the master volume is gonna range between negative six dB and zero dB depending on the demo that I'm using. I'll try to call it out for each demo though. All right guys, just a quick disclaimer as well. I'm sure you're well aware, but obviously this isn't going to be an accurate representation of what the subwoofer is capable of. The camera mic isn't going to pick it up properly. The device you're listening on is going to represent it differently. So just a disclaimer, I'm sure that you're all well aware of though. All right guys, and make sure you stay tuned closer to the end of the video just for fun. I'm going to see how far I can place a candle away from the 24 Ultra and see if it can blow it out using the edge of tomorrow. All right, some of the demos we're going to be doing today is Curtain Shaker, Bass I Love You. I'm also going to do some movie demos uh, like Interstellar and 13 Hours. And then of course, closer to the end, I'm going to be doing the edge of tomorrow for the candles. All right guys, so without further ado, let's get into this video. Let's get into these demos. Let's do it. All right guys, so this is Curtain Shaker. And I forgot to mention that the EQ setting on the subwoofer is no EQ. And this is Curtain Shaker at reference volume, so zero dB. Let's do it. Alright guys, so just so you know, I am running only the LFE24 Ultra, I'm not running my TV3612 for this test. This is Bass I Love You with the AVR set to negative 2 dB. Let's do it. Guys, that is incredibly intense. I can literally feel my whole body, like almost the skin shaking during that song. I didn't know that that one was that intense, but I guess I've never had a subwoofer for this intense. That one was crazy, guys. All right, guys, so here is 13 hours, uh, the scene where they drop one of the mortar shells on top of the building, and this is one of the most intense I've experienced yet. And um, this is at negative six dB on the ABR. Alright guys, I can't show too much of the movies or I'm going to get busted for copyright. Uh, so that was just a short clip, but that's one of the most basiest scenes anyway. And that was literally intense. My body, every part of my body was shaking. My clothes were shaking. <laughs> this thing is intense, guys. It's a lot of fun. Alright, so here we are with the interstellar wormhole scene. This is another one that's very intense with the subwoofer. Uh, actually, this one I think I have at negative 8 dB just because the room can't handle so much. So here we go. copyright that's where I'm gonna stop it <laughs> it was getting really crazy in here guys the whole room was going nuts uh, so that's another fun one so I think right now I'm gonna move on to the candle and edge of tomorrow so let's see how far we can blow a candle out with edge of tomorrow all right guys so this is the edge of tomorrow uh, scene and I'm gonna start the candle at three feet away
All right, so that was way too easy. I think we're gonna add at least three feet to that. All right, guys, so this is with the candle exactly six feet away. Let's see if it blows it out now. All right, so at six feet away, it could still blow it out towards the end. So let's try seven feet. All right, guys, we're getting pretty far away now. I'm not sure if you can see it, but the flame is in the bottom left-hand corner of the screen here. We're at seven feet away, and here we go. All right, so seven feet is a little bit too far away. There was a lot of flickering, but it didn't quite blow it out. So let's try six and a half feet. And by the way, guys, this is with the volume of the AVR at negative 11. I can't go too much more than that. My house starts going crazy. All right, guys, so here we are at six and a half feet. Volume still negative 11 dB on the AVR. Well, let's hit it. Alright guys, so it looks like the limit is about six and a half feet. So it did blow out the candle towards the end there, but seven feet's a little too much. So there you have it. Scientific information, the Funk LFE 24 Ultra can blow out a candle at six and a half feet. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was actually a lot of fun to make. The whole house was going crazy. Uh, I don't think my house liked it very much. Something did fall down upstairs. I have yet to find out what it was, but we did hear something fall. I did get a bit of stink eye, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, we'll see what I broke, if anything, hopefully nothing. And I hope you enjoyed the experiment, <laughs> the scientific experiment, where I did blow out a candle at six and a half feet. I know guys, it doesn't mean anything, but it was a lot of fun. It's hard for me to portray what this subwoofer is like on a video, uh, so I hope this does help a little bit, but the best way to describe it is just violent bass, but it's clean and accurate. Your clothes are shaking. Your skin feels like it's vibrating. The whole room is energized. Like my house is a four level split home. The only level I can seal off is the basement. And all three levels are just energized. Everything's shaking. Doors are vibrating. Um, I did get a quick shot of the window. I'll see if it's clear enough. I'll include it in the video, but my upstairs window, you could see it shaking. The door was shaking. This thing's just nuts, guys. I wish you could experience it for yourselves, so hopefully this video helps. If you're new, please subscribe, tick the bell icon if you like awesome videos like this, and if you do like them, hit the like button. It really encourages me to keep doing stuff like this. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and as always, stay techy.